If you like this video, go ahead and hit that like button. Go ahead and subscribe. And thank you so much for watching. Enjoy the video. Okay, I've climbed up a bit, but this is where the tree has fallen over and like more has fallen over here. And then I've got to block this because somehow, some way, there's water getting into my room. No one else's room, but my room. And then I gotta get, I gotta get all this crap off of the roof. Like I think more has fallen from this tree. And yeah, I gotta, gotta fix all this. I don't think the tarp I got's big enough for this. I don't know if you can see it here, but. Okay, this is what this is what it looks like. See all this? Okay, I don't think the tree can drop much more onto the house. Hopefully, I still have to cut it down. I have to cut it down because like we were we were pricing it with like pe people you know that actually cut down trees, and because it's that close to the house, it's probably like six thousand dollars to get it cut down. I was like, I don't got six thousand dollars. Like, I can I can I can make it happen. Wow. I mean, wow. Home ownership. Now I'm gonna move all these branches into the yard. Hopefully we can set them on fire later. Have another bonfire video. But yeah. Okay, found out why there's water coming in. Because there's a freaking hole. <sighs> I moved the branch that was in there. Uh, but yeah, a hole. <gasps> okay, while I was sitting up here Watching, I wasn't watching anything. I don't know what I was like. Okay, yeah, I'm getting ahead of myself. It's while I was sitting up here, I was thinking about the fact that me and my little one just watched uh, Tomb Raider, the the remake or the reboot, and uh, I really liked it. It was really good. It was really good. Solid action adventure. I like how it wasn't as corny as the other ones. Uh, the Angelina Jolie ones were really kind of corny, uh, but uh, this one not not as corny. So a very entertaining, uh, solid movie. If you haven't seen it, you should probably check it out. If you're in the mood for a good action adventure, you know, it's good. But I got a, a character off screen. I got a a broom that I'm holding like a javelin for some reason. But uh, probably because I'm sitting Indian style on the roof right now. I was waiting for it for a while and then I got it. But um, I'm gonna sweep up the thing here and then put a tarp over that hole so it can't get any worse at least it did take me a while to get up here uh if you have branches falling on on your house or something like that or anything like of this nature don't don't put it off okay because the sooner you get to it the sooner you're gonna cure the problem i've made the problem a little bit bigger because of the fact that there's obviously like with the water's coming in on the roof there's obviously mold i can Flick that picture up real quick, but there's obviously mold there, so I'm gonna have to take off that piece of roof and put another piece of roof on till I patch this hole up. So, yeah. But now it's time to sweep. <sighs> but uh, my brother-in-law was because like. Like I said, when we priced this, because of the fact that it's so close to the house, and we got the fence there, my brother-in-law, like I was, I was calling some places. It's gonna be like six thousand dollars to to cut this tree down because of where it's at. And my brother-in-law was suggesting that we cut it and then just let it fall right here because we aren't even using any of that stuff. 
and I was like, um, I'm like, I'm, it, it's running through my mind. That'd be cool if I like, I could paint one of the walls in the back here, like green and then use it in a scene in a movie, like get out of the bar and have somebody run and then you just, you know, and then like just, just film the tree falling into there with the green painted wall and then go ahead and replace the green painted wall with the scene from inside here and then make it look like it, you know, happened right there. That, that could be cool. It's just, wow. Okay, I'm back on the roof. I bought this stuff today. Some seal stuff. It says do not inhale or you die or something or another, and, but I gotta open it. I hope I, I'll just hold my breath. And, and, um, but it is weatherproof. As you can see that right there. It's probably not gonna focus because my face is so pretty. No, uh, it's got a waterproof seal and all that stuff on there. So the plan is, as you see, the hole doesn't look that bad now because I lifted up the, the tiles and stuff like that, but it's still there, so rain's gonna get in there if it rains. Tomorrow is a 50% chance of rain, so I'm gonna make this happen right now. Ooh, look at all the fog. Sorry. Um, I, I bought a, a... Oh, okay. I bought a placemat. It's a plastic placemat. I couldn't find a piece of plastic. But I was thinking about putting it over this way or covering it up like that and then I'm gonna take all these stray tiles here that I found on the, 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 the barn area over here and just yeah just blew the crap out of that basically I'm I'm using all this this is getting gone and we're gonna make this happen yeah okay that's what it's looking like Hopefully that's good because I put I put a whole bunch of it like around the hole itself and then put the that down and then put that down and then put enough stuff here to hopefully you know so it doesn't catch rain and then put some stuff here and here so it doesn't catch rain as well. Hopefully that's good enough. Oh boy, I hope. Oh, did you really? Huh? Did you really? I thought it was cool. Okay. <laughs> Alright, thank you, thank you. Bye. Wait, wait, wait. What the hell? I took it home last night, okay? Sorry. Okay. <laughs> Looks like something came in the mail.
It is the other poster. 